All right, what's up guys? So it's been about 14, 15 hours since the Fizz Super Saiyan Kid Trunks and Super Saiyan Kid Goten banner dropped on the global side of the game. And in today's video, as always, we're gonna be taking a look at the top grossing charts to determine whether or not us global players can expect any kind of top grossing stones and top grossing rewards over the next couple of days. Now, I guess the first thing I'll say before we get into it is I'm feeling a little conflicted right now because on the one hand I'm kind of disappointed but on the other hand I'm actually kind of proud of global players so uh, I'll explain what that means in a second but for now we are on a sensor tower we are filtered by June 1st 2021 which is today all categories the iOS store and we're starting here with the US. And uh, yeah, as you can see, Tokon's not even in the top eight, nine, top 10. We would have to go all the way down to number 22 to find Dokkan. Now, obviously the release of the banner did still increase the game standings by quite a bit, right? Up 240 spots yesterday to number 22 on the top grossing charts but we're not anywhere close to number one i'm not even going to pretend there's a chance that we're going to get there so uh, the us is definitely out of the running now moving on to france which is you know typically a pretty good performer now obviously deezer is um a lot of times kind of the gatekeeper for number one but right now it looks like clash of clans is at number one and Dokkan is at number four in France which is decent but uh still not looking great there either now we have Luxembourg and this one was very very disheartening because um you know when I saw the US and when I saw France I was like okay that's okay that's fine because we got Luxembourg man Luxembourg has uh come through for us more often than not these days and when I got here, I was like, am I filtered by the right day, like June 1st? Is it 2021? Because this doesn't make any sense. We just got a new banner. Where is Dokkan? And I had to get down to... Oh, man, I had to go down to number 28. I just don't understand. <laughs> I don't know what's going on, man. Number 28 to find Dokkan in Luxembourg, of all places. You know what? I have an explanation for this, actually. I have a pretty solid explanation, but uh, for now, let's just get through a few other regions. So we have Belgium is uh, at number, I don't know, 50, 100, maybe I missed it. I, not, not close. Not Where is, where is Dokkan in Belgium? Hold on. It, it must be in the top 100. I, I think I missed it. I think I missed it oh no this is may 31st okay okay no no no. okay <laughs> so that was actually a mistake okay that was that was actually a mistake so dokkan in belgium on the first is at number 26 okay so false alarm there false alarm there and then for hong kong uh in hong kong we're at number 11 which is better than i expected and we have a cow i don't know why i didn't filter by june 1st in these regions that's really strange uh, for Macau, we're actually doing quite a bit better at number 7. And then we have Spain, number 14. And then we have Germany, which is probably in the top 20 or so. Uh, 28. Okay, so not quite. And then we have Switzerland, number 38 in Switzerland. And what else do we have here? Portugal. Wait, did I do Portugal already? I might have done Portugal already. I don't know. Portugal is number... Uh, 52nd. Number 52. Nice. <laughs> and then uh, there's Italy, which I'm going to guess is probably not doing so hot either. Number 18. Okay, and finally, my country, Canada. There's no chance, but we always check just for, just for fun. And Canada is right now looking at 
Number... Oh god, 39 in the rankings. Now one thing you might have noticed is um, Legends is pretty much consistently higher than Dokkan right now on any of the rankings. Um, and the reason for that is, of course, is because they have their anniversary right now, or it's starting. Or maybe I started yesterday. I'm not really sure. I don't follow Legends too closely. I know a lot of you guys want to see me do Legends content, but I'm still not really sure if, uh, you know, it makes sense for my channel. But nonetheless, uh, Legends is consistently higher right now, and I think that's a big reason why Dokkan is not performing as well compared to, you know, normal, right? Like, although this is not any kind of special banner, um, it does have discounts. It is... It does have quite a few hype featured units, I would say. And um, it also, I mean, at least it has Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta. That's what I meant by hype. It has Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta. And I feel like a decent amount of people are actually excited for the kid Goten and Trunks. But nonetheless, it is still a regular Dokkan Fest. So I wasn't expecting too much. But I think it, if it wasn't for the fact that, uh, you know... That, that Legends was having their anniversary right now. We would have done a lot better. But as I said in the beginning of this video, man, I'm actually kind of proud of these results because myself and a bunch of other, you know, content creators and just people on social media and all that stuff have said, right, over and over again, save for the anniversary. It's coming up in a, in a month. Don't fall for the trap, even though I did spend quite a few stones yesterday, but that's besides the fact that, that was for... The channel um but my, my point is my point is uh it seems like a lot of people are listening or at least uh coming to the conclusion themselves that they should be saving for the anniversary and even though it's really you know kind of sad to see dokkan struggling here to even break the top 50 in some of these regions um it is kind of nice to see that people are you know saving their money saving their stones and getting ready for the anniversary and of course that's gonna be it's gonna be amazing I'm, I'm super stoked for it so look forward to a lot of summons look forward to a lot of top grossing too at that time okay even though we haven't consistently been able to hit top grossing i can i can guarantee you we will get you know at least like 10 regions during the sixth anniversary we're gonna get like 150 stones probably in top grossing overall and the drought is almost over for top grossing so uh yeah there's your update and uh obviously this time around i do not expect us to get top grossing but um i guess there's always a chance with like france for example but it's very unlikely i would not expect any top grossing stones for this banner that's for sure and uh yeah thank you guys so much for watching today's video as always if you liked the video then make sure to like the damn video and if it's your first time watching me, first time to the channel, and you like what you see, then definitely hit that big red subscribe button to join the Tiger Squad now. And while you're at it, hit that notification bell too, so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And that's it. I'm out of here. Until next time, hope you guys have a fantastic, fantastic day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media. Signing out.